Really am. Get rid of these idiots. Look at that. Beautiful. There we go. Great. Who are you? Let's go, Mr. Follower. What brought you to this infernal place? I must destroy the skeleton king. There we go. We got this guy. Hmm. You gotta be close to, uh... Oh, I'll unlock the third. Only get three, obviously, in this stage. In the first playthrough. Um, I don't know exactly how many playthroughs it's gonna take, but I am level 12 on my barb, and I think he's done three or four? Something like that. It is the skeleton king you so. Then you will have to fight your way past John so yeah, and uh, and then you know again, level thirteen is going to be the cap, and we'll make sure we get to that. Obviously, that's spooky holes in the ground. We get this waypoint too. That would have been good uh, on my demon hunter. Although I think the one that I got was probably a lot better than whatever this is. 12.5, wow, that's actually a lot of damage. Hmm. You don't get hurt by those. <laughs> FYI. Destructible environments falling hurt only the bad guys, not you. Kill Jondar. We must find him first. There we go. And right this way. Where's John Dar? Down the stairs? Yeah. All right. Black magic Take care of that away. Templar. But the will of a Templar is stronger. Anything in the chest? Just some gold. All right. So here we go. Let's get this mofo. You were a Templar, John Dar. How could you succumb to this? So easy with that mobility. Awesome. Absolutely. Positively, fantastically, awesome. Betrayal can never be forgiven. <laughs> ADD coming through there. All right, what do I got there? 8.4 damage on the one-handed axe. I will replace this. Great. Yes, Templar, uh, you can have whatever the hell you want. Don't care. <laughs> Let's just keep going, please, sir. And yeah, I guess I'll keep him along with me. Here we go. This is a great opportunity for a missed lashing tail kick. <laughs> great, great opportunity for that. <laughs> when do you not want to miss a lashing tail kick, after all? Arcane Enchanted. Oh, frick. Ugh. All right, so the Arcane Enchanted, uh, really dangerous as a melee character. Something to realize. You just, that, they, just that, those Hydras do so much damage so quickly now once he's dead they should eventually dissipate I, I don't know what's taking them so long there we go you see like the arcane enchanted guy even died and they were still sticking around that's what blew up my barbarian and the fact that i don't know i'm not going to make any excuses but i just wasn't expecting it i wasn't prepared wasn't paying attention either let's drop this for fun watch those physics in play I think I got another dash left. Yes, I do. Dash up into the next group. Get some of that long reach going. That guy needs to die fast. Sweet. Done. Nice massacre. Plus 112 bonus. 21 guys killed in a row. I wonder, I should try to make some videos of like uh, trying to cap those things, you know, see how high we can get with them. Hmm, is that going to be an increase too? It's not 6.3. Not as good as what I'm currently sitting at. In fact, ooh, let me hold on to that for the Witch Doctor. And hopefully, possibly that for my Wizard. That's an increase. And... No, 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 no. <clears throat> I need an amulet, shoulders, and a head, which I really have right now. Uh, yeah, I'll just get rid of all this stuff. Okay, cool. 
Well, let's keep moving then. Not gonna go down there because I know that that doesn't lead to the next area. This looks a little pro more promising. Wow, bunch of baddies here. All right, are these the splitters? No, poison. There we go. Make sure we stay away from that. Got a bunch of fiends here as well. Um, I did notice too that those those giant grotesque guys. Uh, besides the worms, they they drop those fiends. So. Alright, before we do that, let's pick up some loot here, shall we? Alright, well now let's go up. Actually, the Templar, I think he's got abilities. I haven't even been paying attention to the follower. Don't worry, I'll make a video on him. <laughs> I'll make a video about him at some point. Alright, so the Templar, let's give him... Uh, I don't think I need the heal. Let's give him Intervene. A worthy choice. I might even, uh, maybe if I find a better mantra, I don't know right now. Yeah, I'm just sitting on that one. So level nine, I got reflected damage. Um, <clears throat> so I might even, because I haven't really been using the lashing tail kick for, as uh, that often. Although I'm assuming that on bosses I will be. Might have to hold on to it, really. There we go. Holy crap. It's all right. I'll just let it regen. Weapon rack, anything? No, hand wrap. Here we go, here we go. Tomb Guardians. Arcane Enchanted again. These guys piss me off. Where is this idiot? All of these guys? Jesus. Try to avoid that another one not a fan of those guys at all got some gloves oh no stay away <laughs> arcane enchant how you trump me so all right gloves not worth it oh. <laughs> look at these guys what are you doing coming up through them windows you really think you know what's interesting when you see your buddies climbing through the window and they get blown to smithereens is it really that wise to continue to climb don't you think that they would start to move in the opposite direction? I suppose they don't have much of a thought process though, so maybe that's the problem. Bouncing through these mobs. Still getting hit though, because they spin around instantly. Nothing up there. Why am I trying to walk up there? Silly. Pygmies, come here. There are forces arrayed against us that are stronger than we ever imagined. This will be good for the lashing tail. There it is. And level eight. Nice. Let's see what I get this time. Crippling wave. Okay. Take a quick look at that before we continue along. All right. So, crippling wave. That is going to be a spirit generator. A series of large sweeping attacks that cause 100% weapon damage to all enemies in front of you. Crippling Wave attacks Daze enemies, slowing movement by 50%. So that is Crippling Wave. Uh, so this is a much more arced damage. This is kind of an area damage as opposed to the direct damage of Deadly Punch. I will use it uh, for now so you guys can see what it looks like. There you go. The series of waves generates. And what is it? Uh, six per attack. So same as the other ones. But this is going to require me to be basically right on top of the targets um, to to be able to do the crippling wave, as opposed to having that that little bit of a range there in deadly reach. Mm. Uh, okay, cer certainly assuming that I have to go back the other way. Yeah, got to go back up here. It's probably going to be to the northwest, or it could be down here as well, but. All right, so let's get some crippling wave in action. Once we head back here, too much backtracking. I'm not sure if that's really doing much because of the pause. I don't know if with the pause it's actually <coughs> much of a gain. There we go. So I mean, this could work, especially with the mobility, you know. And of course, here it is. The Royal Crips, we're getting there, guys. We're getting there. I 
I like the having the snare is nice too, though. And I, I suppose that with the large amount of groups that are kind of just a, one massive group, um, that it it makes sense to have kind of a conal damage. So bypass this, head straight on over to right here. Wow, this is going to be nice and easy with my dashing strike. And actually, I think I can still get these guys. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. All right. So obviously the big disadvantage with this though is that it's it is less damage on a direct target because it's 100% weapon damage as opposed to the 120. So. So yeah, that's something to keep in mind as well. Not not as much damage, but obviously like in an area like this, the conal damage uh, proves to be worthwhile. When you're when you're kind of surrounded by mass amounts of enemies, and in all honesty, just in um, just in Diablo in general, I mean, you there's so much of your time is kind of being overwhelmed by huge hordes. You know, it's it, there's very rarely are you just against like a single <laughs> a single opponent. You know, um, so overall, kind of an AOE type of uh, character proves to be very effective in the uh, single player and co-op gameplay. In PvP, it's it's, sing it's all about the single target DPS, but. I mean, we're not even having PvP in the beta, so it doesn't really make too much sense to talk about it, since it doesn't really, uh, it's not really applicable, you know? Yeah, let's go, next area, Crypt of the Skelly King. Let's get as much of this as possible. Yep, you're right, I won't. <laughs> oh, ha, 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 ha. All right, let's take care of these idiots really quick. All right, now we know what we're coming up against, so let me figure out what I would like to use. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go for Deadly Reach over Crippling Wave for the boss fight, most certainly. Uh, lashing, Tail Kick, and Dashing Strike. <laughs> Does that sound good to you guys? I think, that, I think that'll work quite well. <clears throat> I could do the Breath of Heaven for that heal. You know what, if things get hairy, I'll, I'll just throw that on, but I don't think I'll need to. I think that with my mobility plus the range of the Deadly Reach, I should be A-OK. -okay. But we'll find out. <clears throat> Let's go, Skelly King. What say you? And yeah, as you notice, I don't, I'm not going to grab a ma Mantra. I need level 9 for that. and Eh, don't really care. Uh, dodge, passive dodge. I only have, you know, three active slots available right now, so. <clears throat> Don't know if that's uh, gonna be something that I wanna do. Wow, he's hitting the Templar. See how easy it is to avoid that damage? And of course I walked into that one. All right, so it's not bad at all. And I'm getting a little bit of regen. This is going well. Yeah, yeah, I mean, you can dodge most of that, so. That's pretty OP. I think that the monk's gonna be really solid as well for hardcore mode. I really do. Really think that that's gonna work really well in hardcore in hardcore mode. Having having these uh, having these opportunities to avoid all this damage. There we go. Let him take out his own buddies. Actually, just go ahead and help potion that up. And here we go. Just about the final leg here. Whoops. There we go. And see you later, buddy. Nice, nice, nice. I got some cloth pants there. And that's nice because I think a caster is going to be next. So let's see if that's any uh, nice caster abilities. And beautiful. Congratulations. I've defeated the Diablo 3 beta again. And congratulations to you guys for making it through yet another playthrough. This time, of course, the monk. I will take a quick look at what we picked up. 
Let's see here. Rare pants. Let's take a look at these bad boys. See if these are worthwhile. Ooh, there we go. Point two life per second. Two percent better chance to find magical items. Plus six vitality and increased base experience by plus one per kill. That is very nice. I'll be happy to uh, throw that on my next playthrough character. And holy crap, I can't believe I missed that I had that. Uh, let me throw that javelin of the flame on for when I uh, when I play the monk next. But nice, some pretty solid stuff here. And that will do it for this Monk playthrough. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you have enjoyed this. Uh, next will be, uh, well, yet another playthrough. I believe it's either Witch Doctor or Wizard yet. Next, we're just going uh, straight down in order. So I'm pretty sure it's going to be Witch Doctor. But yeah, stay tuned for that. Thank you guys so much for watching this Let's Play series. Uh, hopefully it has been uh, proving to be entertaining for you guys. Keep in mind, after this Let's Play, as I've reiterated before, we'll be doing lots of other uh, Diablo 3 content, so stay tuned for that. Best place on YouTube for Diablo 3 content right here on this channel. Make sure you subscribe. Thanks for watching, guys. As always, keep watching and keep owning. Huzzah! What? So overpowered. <laughs>